What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough. Okay, so... God dang, this game is taking so long. I really mean that. Uh, I don't know. I, yeah, it, yeah. We gotta continue on right here because we are still in Valencia Island, uh, Meadow Town and all that stuff. We defeated the first gym leader right here in the Orange Islands. Now, we have to go straight into this meadow or forest or something because something's going on. Yes, the Forest of Myth, and well, I thought I was going to like enter something right there, and what does it say? Uh, Course of the Cave, Route 50, wow, so many routes, and would you look at that? They just appear out of nowhere. Route 1 says, hey you, this place belongs to us. Leave us now and there won't be any trouble. Dot, dot, dot. Are you deaf? He said get out of here right now. If that's how you want to play, fine. I challenge you to a battle. He almost said duel. And that's a pretty good song right there. And, uh, well, this is new. A uh, Nexus Grunt. Okay, so, what the... Okay, so, yeah, what the heck is going on right here? Yeah, so, here we go. We're gonna be battling against Cy Tauros and Scyther right here. Two very, oh, two very powerful Pokemon. And, well, I... Uh, Nexus. Team Nexus? Is that what it is? God dang it, I don't even know. I just wanna get this game done, but, god dang, there's a lot of... Teams out here, Team Saturn, Team Rocket for a long period of time, and Team Nexus. Holy crap! So there we go, another Ice Punch, and yeah, this freaking yeah, he's gonna he's gonna keep on healing up his Pokemon right there. So I'm gonna gang up on one guy right here and uh, hit him with everything we got. So let's go with this guy right here, Surf Attack, and. What the hell, man? This guy will not give up right here. So here we go, another sky attack, and, uh, well, there it is. Whoa, that was close. I was taking it out. These guys look like they don't look mean at all. Aw, oh, crap, I was completely thrashed. Huh. So, what the hell was that all about? It probably had something to do with Zane or Axel, whatever his name is. And here we have a level 41 Bell Sprout. Do not want to battle that, so let's see what kind of Pokemon we can find right here. Oh, lots of uh, grass type Pokemon. Okay, so some stuff that we already got. And, well, we're just gonna have to follow the green road right here, and here we have another Team Nexus guy. What are you doing here? This place is restricted campus. Now, I actually thought that they were gonna come out with like Team, uh, team Aqua or Team Magma's theme song because that's what it sounded like at the beginning, but. It's probably not the case right there, so let's just beat this guy. Ball 65, coming out with the Persian. Let's go with Shroomly right here. And a bam. Look at that. Persian has been defeated. Okay, next grind. You're too strong. Yes, I am. Okay, so I am recording this thing on May 31st. Last night, I was so goddamn tired, guys. I was really, really tired, and right now, I'm barely recovering my strength right here, and... Oh, God, I haven't seen you around here before. Are you a Nexus member? No, but maybe Wade Barrett, Justin Gabriel, you know, Ryback, those guys in the Nexus, before John Cena buried them completely, you know, that kind of stuff. If you guys aren't a wrestling junkie, then uh, you guys probably won't get the joke right there. But anywho, yeah, I was super tired. Super tired, and that's why it kind of sounded a little monotone, but the other thing, too, is just like, good God, this game has lasted a long, long time. So many storylines, I could see why there was a... Well, why this game has become so popular, or is popular, or whatever, and here we go with the surf, that takes care of Haunter, and obviously you're not a member then. So he's probably insinuating that his team members suck. So, let's see. What the hell's going on right here? Nothing. Okay, so let's go right ahead and do surf, and let's see, right here. Found ourselves a full restore, which is good, and... Let's go again with the surf, and wow, look at that. It, lo it actually looks like a Lapras right there, and getting attacked by a Remoraid, so they finally found a spot for Remoraid, and take this guy, wow, it's a Pokemon, okay. Okay, so let's see, why are we here? We are guarding the entrance to the Corsola Cave. Okay, alrighty, so let's speed this up right here. Going up against Arbok, and well, let's go with the Dragon Claw. Nope, there's the stockpile, but here we go again with another Dragon Claw. And he'll be coming out with the Absol. 
these guys come out with, like, you know, poison and normal slash dark type Pokemon. Yeah, you're too weak for this one. Okay, so already I've taken their confidence and all that stuff, so... Continue on right here with our adventure, battling Whipping Bells, Bell Sprouts, and all that stuff. And... Ooh, look at that, Beautifly. Okay, so they made Beautifly a wild Pokemon right here. And... Well, there's... There's more trainers right there. Yeah, at some point I'm gonna have to put on some repels right now. And did I already battle this guy? No, I didn't. So let's go. We're gonna be battling this guy right here. He's coming out with an electrode. Let's go with a physical attack. Bam. Look at that. And look at that. Level 92. And he's gonna be coming out with an aggron. So let's just continue. Alright. Surf attack. So easily, Erwin has become my strongest Pokemon ever. And, well, this is a hack game, so... Does it really count? Does it really, really count? I don't know, because... Jesus, this hack game is making us do some crazy stuff. So now let's go right ahead and switch it out to Godzilla Godzilla. And... Let's see, do these guys want to battle us? What do you say? Nobody goes through the exit until the boss is finished in Corsola Cave. Okay, so that right there is misleading. So let's go right ahead and battle some more Pokemon. Okay, so... Okay, screw it. Let's go right ahead and use a Max Repel if we even have any. And, well, let's see, let's see, let's see. There's a Rick Candy. And, uh, let's see, let's see. Where in the mother-loving HE double hockey stick? Ah, oh, there we go. We got nine. We got nine left. Okay, so, here we have this guy. Hey, you there! Which, which do you think is cooler? Team Nexus uniform or Team Saturn's? I don't know. You guys are just wearing regular t-shirts. That's all. And it literally looks like the wrestler's uh, uniform, you know, like, uh, you know, WWE's Nexus and all that stuff. That's what I'm thinking. So here we go, flamethrower, and look at that. No more Tauros, and yes, I kicked your butt. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, so, let's see. There's a Pokeball right there. We found ourselves an Energy Powder. Always nice to have that. And, well, this must be, yes, this is the entrance, this is Route 49. And we're going to be battling some other guy. Halt, who goes there? Okay, so we're going to take on a Persian right here. And more flamethrower, just kicking butt. And we're just going to continue on right here because, yes, Godzilla can do the job kicking butts. And he's coming out with his baby partner, Charmeleon. And look at that. Charmeleon thinks he can take up, beat up Big Brother. But really, that's not going to be the case right there. And, well, let's see. God dang. How many trees do you have to beat? Okay, so we're just gonna be kicking, we're just gonna be speed training through this whole thing right here because really, like how many trainers does it take to actually stop me? It's not a lot, but you know what can stop me? Food. Lots and lots of food. Okay, let's see what this guy has to say. Hey, do you listen to Oak's Pokemon talk? I do not. Okay, so Aggron right here, Flamethrower again. Takes him out. Sizor coming out, and this is the first time I'm actually battling against the Sizor, and that is cool. Coming out with an Absol, so let's go with Shroom Lee right here. And here we go, Sky Uppercut does its thing, and another easy Pokemon to just beat, and this guy survives and uses his counter attack, which, god dang it, I've, I've fallen for some counter attacks before right now. And, well, there's a. We'll restore and look at that. Slot King has been defeated. Now we gotta revive one of my Pokemon right here. So let's see. Actually, no, it's the wrong case. Okay, there it is. Revive! Let's go right ahead and revive Shroom Lee. And. Let's go to full restore. Full restore. And full restore. Okay, so we are set. And there is a buttload of Pokemon. I am uh, the head admin of this job. You have come far enough. It's time for you to go home. I am rolling my eyes right now, and you look like an average guy right now. Coming out with a pretty cool Pokemon, and look at it. Hariyama using a Seismic Toss and a Hyper Potion, and there we go. No more Hariyama. I'm going to continue on right here with Sneasel. So, Flamethrower will melt him down to the ground. And, well, Haunter. Another person that I'm going to haunt down, or I'm just going to melt down. And here we come out with a Mag or a Magmar. So let's go back to Erwin right here. And... Let's get this. Surf attack does its thing. 
And uh, well, let's see. I want to know who the master is in this whole in this whole gen this whole thing. And here we found ourselves the TM12 Sweet Scent. Yeah, it is not important right now. Okay, so here we are in the Corsola Cave. And yes, we do have a Pokemon with Waterfall. So that's a that's a big plus right there. Okay, so let's go with the Waterfall. Let's go, Irwin. I'm pretty sure we're gonna find some like legendary Pokemon right here. Yeah, well, I can I can I can bet it. I am betting on that stuff. And let's see, there's nothing here. So let's just go right ahead and surf again. Actually, hold on. There's, there might be something right here. Yeah, which is another waterfall. And let's go. So this is going to be a lot of waterfalls in one setting. It's a new plus. And uh, let's see. Waterfall. Going to speed that up. And let's see. Okay, so there's an entrance right there. Pretty sure I got the right way or the wrong way. I don't even know. There's multiple entrances. And <laughs> I've never seen you here before. How did you get in? What? You beat all the guards? This is a serious problem. You can't exit through here. Uh, okay. Okay, so that is not the leader, but I'm kind of wondering what this is. Another confusing area of uh, Valencia Island. And oh, dang it. Okay, so I'm gonna be pressing this button to no end because we gotta speed through this. Let's see. All right, so let's go right here. There's, I see an item. And there's another one right here, Shoal, Shoal Salt, and well, let's see, too many waterfalls, god dang it, this one's the biggest of them all, and we found ourselves a Carbos, and no we can't cross that, right here, okay, and would you look at that, capture every last one of them, don't let them, don't let any get away. And look at that, Zane, he's like, oh, it's you. I had a feeling you would reach me. Well, I'm not interested in battling you here today, as I have much more important plans. I have changed, Draven. I have become more evil towards people and Pokemon since I joined Team Rocket. Michelle, that fool, inspired me to do something. Team Nexus. I'm here to capture some cores left for me and Team Nexus. That's right, I've formed my own criminal organization, Team Nexus. With the new evil scientists that work for me, I can create anything for Pokemon. Like Potion that will make a Pokemon instantly grow five levels. A liquid that is contained inside Corsola's branches is what is needed to make it. When Corsola's branch breaks, it grows back in the in just one night. Well, I'm done with you. My men have grabbed enough Corsola to make 9,000 potions. What the hell? Just try and stop us. Go oh, down. And here's the officer, and he's like, thank you for getting rid of those men. What? They took some Corsola, and they are planning experimenting on them? That's criminal. The leader of this group must be found. You say his name is Zane? Thank you for your cooperation. Well, that is a twist. Yeah. That is a twist of uh, event right there. I did not know. Well, that, that, that's actually pretty cool that, you know, Corsola is a... Uh, branches can actually yeah of course those branches can actually make a potion like that so I'm assuming that's where all the levels got leveled up or something so I'm gonna try and capture this Corsola and there you go I caught myself Corsola who would ever say that Dra Draven doesn't like to capture Pokemon and look at that Corsola the coral Pokemon in a in the a South Sea nation the people live in the communities that are built on groups of Corsola okay so it's probably talking about Hoenn in Pacific Lockdown and, well, let's go back to the Max Potion right here. Or Max Repel. Alright, let's get the H out of here. And, uh, well, let's, go, let's go ahead and continue our adventure. Now, I see an item right there. And that leads to nowhere. So, let's continue on. Let's go. Um, okay, so I don't know how to get out of here. How in the heck did I get here? I don't know. Uh, let's see. Oh, we go down here. And we're going to go right here. And we're gonna just surf by right here because. God dang it. There we go. Surf, surf, surf. Surf down. And now we can get through this exit right here. And would you look at that? We're in Valencia Port, right where we started. So, let's see. I do not know what's next right here. I really don't. So, after taking care of that situation, let's see. 
kind of don't know what to do next, so let's see. We're going to be going a few routes here and there. And maybe visiting Professor Ivy, if that's the case. And let's see. I don't know. Professor Ivy, she's a good-looking uh, kind of professor right there. So let's go right here. And let's see. Go up there. And let's see what Professor Ivy has to say to us. Hello there, Draven. I see that you delivered the GS ball safely to Professor O. Return to put Orange League. Okay, so we can't do that. Anything right here. Alright, so I guess we're going to have to continue our adventure. I guess we're going to have to move to Meadow whatever land. Let's see. Meadow, or of course the myth. Okay. So, here we are in Meadow Town, and we've already defeated Gym Leader right here. So, I'm assuming we can surf, probably. I don't even know. And uh, that leads to nowhere. Okay, so that is that. Magikarp at level 46 is pretty cool. And I should probably think of using freaking Max Repels again. And, well, let's see. I'm trying to find a key right here, because I don't think you could surf. Or you could surf off right here, so I'm assuming... Let's see, talk to this guy. Don't you love the feelings of nice smooth balls in your hand? That book balls, that is. Okay, that was hilarious. And, oh, okay, so I think I know where we need to go now. So, those two guys guarding that area would probably lead, it was probably blocking an area that we need to go to, so let's see, right here, surfing away, okay, I'm a little lost right here, so let's go, Not right there, and, okay, so we're going down right here and well let's see i think we found the exit or yeah it's right there and of course pokemon will keep on attacking us because why not all right so that's that and now we can grab this pokeball right here and we found ourselves a silver pot powder and this one let's see route 50 okay so we're going down to route 50 and here we are route 50 and Leaf Bay City is next, and then of course the Cave of Wisdom, and it looks like to me we're going to be battling. Hey, I just came from the forest, didn't you? I kind of did. Okay, so we got a homeboy here who has a Dragon-type Pokemon, so we're just going to slash slash it away. And look at that, critical hit, does a trick, and Godzilla level 90. And this guy's coming out with a Forestress. And look at that, Steel and Book type Pokemon, not the best combination right there. So he's coming out with a Raichu, and well, let's see, Earthquake Attack never does did us wrong right there. Look at that. And coming out with a Jinx, let's go back to Gungila, and Flamethrower this chick out to the moon, look at that. That was a bit harsh, yes it was. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, so... Okay, I didn't think they were going to battle. My Pokemon will thrash yours! Okay, so he's coming out with an Onyx, and I'm going to keep on flamethrowing everybody because I can. And he's coming with a Machamp, and here we go. Wing Attack, nearly does a trick, and here we go again. Wing Attack, does it, and yeah, that's not fair because my Pokemon are pretty awesome right here. Okay, so what is this? Uh, Rocket Treasure Hunt? Let's see. Oh, right, it. The music. Hey! <laughs> Welcome to the, record, uh, the Rocket Treasure Hunt. Beneath this building is a vast stretch of full, uh, space full of glamorous items. All the cost to go down there is 3,000. Beware though, the path you see isn't what it seems. Yeah, not going there. Uh, not right now for the time being. And well, it looks like we're in an area where there's a bunch of Pokemon trainers right here. So I guess we're gonna con yeah we're gonna continue on right here. Uh, we get to the next town. I think it's Leaf Bay. So let's go with Sparky and just destroy everybody. Okay, so hello there, shall we battle? He's a bird trainer. Did, totally did not know that he was a bird trainer, and well, let's go with Noctowl. Let's get this. Another Noctowl defeated, and Vaster Wast has been defeated. What kind of Pokemon can you find here? Not legendary Pokemon, by the way. Isn't it kind of funny how I like caught legendary Pokemon right like off screen? It's hilarious. I'm catching bug Pokemon, wanna see? Yeah, but I'm gonna destroy him and well, let's go with Thunderbolt and Strength Attack right there. There goes Yama and there. Oh, I was about to say there goes uh, Dust Talk, but 
That sucks, it wants to be mean. So, let's go. Shroomly level 79 does the trick. And, well, let's go right ahead and use another full restore right here. Okay, so what does it say? Force of Myth, Leap Bay City, Cave of Wisdom. Okay, so, let's see. You know, we're gonna be battling everybody. And he wants to see Pokemon right here. So here's a flamethrower, flame breather. So let's go with a thunder attack, and of course it's gonna go with agility. So thunder attack, does it? Nope. Oh wow, I have two different kinds of moves right there. So thunderbolt. And of course Rabidash is gonna be faster than us. And look at that, it did not kill you, but whatever. Okay, so I'm taking a look at every single oh wow, water type Pokemon. Okay, alrighty. That is not a water type Pokemon, by the way. That is a dragon type. Okay, so here we go. Another Thunderbolt. Does the trick. Gonna continue on. Destroy him with all Thunderbolts. The almighty Sparky right here. And he comes with another Seedra. Yeah, buddy. And let's go. Thunderbolt again. For the win. Yes, you do like my style. Okay, so that right there is that, and, well, excuse me, you can't see, I'm trying to fish, uh, fish here. Kids these days. Pretty cranky. Very, very crampy. So, let's continue on, and just using Thunderbolt everywhere, here we go. And, look at that, Thunderbolt again, suck on those lemons. Okay. Okay, so, let's see, another trainer, already beat him. There's an item. Found ourselves a, another rare candy, which is pretty cool. Very, very good. And, well, let's see. We already beat this guy. And we are landing in Leaf Bay City. And from what it looks like, I kind of I kind of want to take a look at this place. Okay, so there is a gym badge right there. And here we're in round 51. Good guy. There's a lot to do here. Okay, so we're going to pause right here, guys. Stay tuned in the next episode. Uh, we're going to take a look at uh, Leaf Bay City and all that stuff. And then we'll see what happens. Yeah. We will see what happens. Thank you, guys.